Hello friends, welcome back. In this tutorial, we will study about deletion in red black tree. If we have to delete a node from a red black tree, then we delete it as we delete from a binary search tree because a red black tree is a binary search tree. When we delete a node from a binary search tree, we always end up deleting the node which is either a leaf or has only one child because we delete an internal node from a binary search tree simply by replacing it by its in-order successor and then we recursively call delete operation on in-order successor node. Right. So we need to handle the cases where a node is a leaf or has only one child. Let V is the node to be deleted and let node u is the only child of node v right which replaces the node v right now here there are two cases first case is either u or v is red right uh, node v is the node to be deleted and node u is the only child of node v right so node v is deleted by replacing it by its only child node u right so node u will replace node v right and here the color of either u or either v is red right so what will we do in this case node v is deleted by replacing it by node u and the color of node u will become black right so we will replace node v by node u and u will be a black node right second case is when both nodes u and v are black right v is the node to be deleted and u is the only child of node v right then the node v is deleted by replacing it by its only child u right so here we will delete node v by replacing it by its only child u right so when node v is replaced by node u then the number of black nodes in the path containing node u is decreased so it will uh, violate the property of red black tree that for each node, all paths from the node to descendant leaves contain the same number of black nodes. Right. To overcome this problem, we will add extra black color on node U. Now node U is double black. When we have to count the number of black nodes in a path containing node U, then we count node U as two black nodes. Now our task reduces to convert this double black to single black, right? Now we have to convert this node U from double black to single black. Now we will convert this node U from double black to single black, right? If node U is root, then we will make it single black. In this case, black height of red black tree is decreased by 1, right? So if a node U is root then we can make it single black right we will remove this extra black color from this node u in this case black height of a red black tree is decreased by one right if node u is not a root node then there are four cases first case is node u's sibling w is red right here node u is double black and its uh, sibling w is red right let parent of node u is node p right since w is red therefore its uh, both children will be black and parent of node w that is also the parent of node u will also be black right now what will we do we will interchange 
the color of node W and its parent P. Right now, P will become red and node W will become black. After this, we will perform left rotation on parent of node U that is on node P. So after performing left rotation on a parent of node U, we will get this red black tree. Right now, node W will become parent of node P. Right and node P will become left child of node W. Now sibling of node U is not rat. Right? Now we have converted first case into second case or third case or fourth case. Now the second case is node U's sibling W is black and both of W's children are black. Right? Now let P is the parent node of node U. P can be either red or black. Right? In this case, what we do, we remove one black color from node U and node W and add extra black color to node P, which is the parent of node U and node W. Now, the node U will become single black and node W is converted from black to red because we have removed one black color from both of these nodes. Right? We have removed one black color from both of these nodes. So node U will become single black and node W will be converted from black node to red node. Right? And if the color of node P is red, then by adding extra black color, it will become black. And if the color of node P is black, then by adding extra black color, it will become double black. Right? So when it uh, becomes double black, when node P becomes double black, right? Then it is considered as node U, right? Then this node P will become new node U, right? In third case, node U's sibling W is black and W's left child is red and W's right child is black, right? Now we have to transform the situation from case third to case fourth. We have to make right child of sibling of node U red, right? Now parent of node U can be either red or black, right? If parent of node U is red, then we will get uh, this type of a uh, red black tree, right? If parent of uh, node U is black, then we will get this type of red black tree, right? Now, what will we do? First, we will exchange the color of node W and its left child, right? We will color exchange the color of node W with its left child right now node w will become red and w's left child will become black right now after this what will we do we do right rotation on node w right when we do right rotation on node w then what will happen we will get this type of red black tree, right? Now the sibling of uh, node U is black with red right child, right? So after doing right rotation on node W, we will get this kind of red black tree, right? And uh, now the sibling of uh, node U is black with red right child, right? So we have transformed the situation from third case to fourth case. Now what is fourth case? Fourth case is U's sibling W is black 
and W's right child is red, right? Parent of node U could be of any color, either red or black. Left child of node W can be of any color, either black or red. So, node U is double black, its sibling W is black, and right child of W is red, right? So, what will we do? First, uh, we will change the color of right child of node W from red to black, right? We will change the color of uh, right child of node W from red to black, right? After this, we will exchange the color of node W with its parent. So, the color of node W will become either red or black depending upon the color of its parent. If its parent is red, then the color of node W will become red. If the color of parent is black, then the color of node W will remain black. In both cases, the color of uh, parent of node W will be black, right? In both cases, the color of parent of node W will become black, right? So after this, we do left rotation on parent of node U and remove extra black color from node U. So what will we do? We will do left rotation on parent of node U and remove extra black color from node U, right? Because now, the path containing node, node u right because now the path containing node u has got a new extra black node so now there is no need of extra black color on node u right so we will remove extra black color from node u now node u is single black right so after left rotation on parent of node u and removing extra black color from node u we will get these red black trees right